girl with a little ginger, garlic, hey. whatever it is. Wow, this girl, is a fraud. <laughs> what is that? What is that? You can't bother my baby. See your baby. Join the conversation, guys. Join it. Hello guys, welcome to another exciting episode of Hot Stuff on TSL Nigeria TV. It's your girl Stephanie and I'm with my guys. It's your buddy Matilda. And you're So how are you guys doing? How's your week going? Fine. 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 Good. good. Hope nothing is stressing you. Obviously everything is stressing me. The economy is not smiling at all. Yeah. Coping with the film scarcity. We have this money changing, this um, new, naira, new naira stuff. Yeah. Just yesterday, even today, they're having they had a protest yeah had Every, a protest because people are time. tired now how would you it's i terrible, heard they're selling black market one liter for one thousand naira. it's terrible it's really, one thousand really naira. okay that's really bad but that's then, that's horrible but because, then god will save this yes like and me. it's a new month guys it's february the month of love happy new, happy month, happy new, new month, month guys we love you guys we love you guys so so much thank you guys for staying with us yeah. all true did you guys notice how january flew by so fast like I can't literally believe we're saying Happy New Month now. Like right. already. That, like we literally like, really shouted Happy New Year two just yesterday. Ago. Which one <laughs> yesterday? Two seconds ago, we're like Happy New Year, guys. I'm glad it did though, because it's usually slow and it's really really frustrating. Like yeah, uh, hurry up, yes, let's leave this place. <laughs> <laughs> but if this is how the year wants to go or more, I have to step up my A game because I have a lot of plans for the year. Uh, yeah, and the, the way it's going so fast, I don't think. <laughs> I think I have to work times two of everything. Yeah, you should if you feel the I need definitely to. Yeah, you should. should. Speaking of the new year, a lot of us had resolutions for this year. We had plans, yeah. and personally, so far, I've been able to keep up. I've been mm. doing really, really good, and I'm really proud of myself. So, guys, did you have any resolutions, and how far have you been able to keep up with it? I definitely do have resolutions, and so far, I think if I was going to rate myself on a scale of one to ten, I'd give myself a six. So that's like a thumbs up for me. Yeah. Well, I've been able to keep up with my new resolutions, and yeah, all. I mean, the year just started, but mm. you've done a lot. Yes, I've done a lot. I mean, proud I did a lot in January. Yeah. Yes, I am. So, do you like have any resolutions yourself that you'd like to share? I have tons, but one that I would say that I am very proud of myself is procrastination. Mm. It was a very big slack for me last year and it affected a lot of my goals. So I have been able to say, okay, I'm going to wake up by seven to run around the road and, you know, do some little work exercise out. to work out. And I have kept, I've kept up with it. So I think I'm, I'm going fine. Speaking I'm of workouts, one of my resolutions this year is to work on my body. Oh, yeah? Yes, I, I need to keep in shape. Not because I'm doing it for anybody. Are you sure? Because, yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Tell me. Yeah. I'm not going to do it for anybody. <laughs> because in this our society, people get body shamed a lot. Yeah, people yeah. Especially do. Especially the girls. And it's really not nice. It's, it's a thing. It's a problem. Like, we really have to talk about it because I really don't understand why somebody will have to be body shamed. I mean, they didn't create themselves. They didn't. Like, the girls really get body shamed. You know, the be big belly, the big boobs, the stretch marks yeah. and all, the folds. Mm -hmm. it's, 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 it's really, really bad. You know, growing up, I had, I was really big, you know, in secondary school and I was really yeah. body shamed. My classmates, my friends, teachers, neighbors. And at some point, it made me cry. It made me feel really bad. I felt inferior. I had low self-esteem in myself. But I had to build my confidence. Yeah, I had to I work on myself. I had to tell myself that you're beautiful. Mm. You get so and that really helped me because at some point and I also decided that okay, I need to work on myself. Mm. I need to look good. So I had to start working on myself. Mm -hmm. And that was it. But that phase that you were in where people were body shaming you, how how did you how did you cope? It felt really terrible for me. Like that alone affected other aspects of my life. I felt really, really down That's... because at some point I felt like, okay, there's no point in trying because yeah. people are not going to, yes, but are still going to laugh at me mm -hmm. and stuff. But I had to tell myself that you can do it, babe. You yes, need you to, yeah. You really can. Yeah. Do yeah. So, like, do you guys have any experiences? Do you guys get body shamed growing up? Or... Yeah, I did. Uh, growing up, I was I was not a fat person. I was on the slim side, like, yeah, but I started growing breasts really early. And my breasts came with stretch marks, you know, when you're growing up and you're having breasts. Normally, your breasts may be very pretty and stuff, but mine was just 
we stretch marks pretty though but then we stretch marks oh. and you get i'd go and buy things and especially this woman may i so rest in hellfire but especially <laughs> this woman you know she every time i go to her shop she's going to be like ah have you been pregnant before uh, man i said ah, touching you. Eh? Small boys with touching your breast, see your breast. It's a, and I felt very, very bad. I it's it really I'm somebody who has confidence. So at that point, I at that point, I uh how would I put it? My confidence level really, really dropped. Yeah. And thank God to my mom. Shout out to my mom. She was there for me. You know, she kept telling me, This is how you are, your body's beautiful. And with time, more exercises and stuff like that. You know, I just it started picking up, it started shaping better itself. Mm. And you know, look at me now. Titties on fleek. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, did you get body shape while you were growing up? Yeah, I did. I did. I mean, I had people talk about my nose and how big it was. Mm. I went to an all girls school, so I get to see oh, them like, like every a day. School. Mm-hmm. Yes. And I get to see them every day and they're like, oh, your nose is too big. And then again, they'll be like, you're too tall. Just please stand stand at the back or something. I used to be at the back of the Azembi ground like I every imagine. single time. Yeah, so I love tall girls. I do. Yeah, I really like them because I feel like you know they can see above us. Above, like yeah. they can, you know, they can yes. see better yes, days. Yes, I, I really I love tall girls. If you are seeing better days, say it's a call fast. So please don't. I can't take it anymore. <laughs> Honestly. But moving back to body goals, do you guys have any celebrities so we can like picture where your body goals are for the year? I used to have Nancy Sime in mind, yeah, mm-hmm. but Chris told me you can't have a body because you're short and all that. But um, I can get it and I'm gonna yes, get you it. Can. Yeah. yeah, you can be a I'm mini Nancy Sime. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> you can be a mini Nancy <laughs> Sime. I think, I think mine is, um, is myself with a bigger ass. I like myself. Yeah. In okay. fact, I lo- I'm obsessed with myself. Yeah, yeah. you look hot and you, 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 you have to. You I have, have to be. To, but I feel like I actually do want to get that booty, you know, that booty of I want it to be a little bit. Oh, that's like uh, ooh, who, are you who are you doing it for, Matilda? Yeah. Who am I doing it for? Who are you doing it for? I'm doing it for your father. <laughs> 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 my father is my father's not available. Please don't don't go uh, there. I'm doing it for myself. Right. Because I love myself. And because I want myself to be all hot and chill. And because I want to feel confident. Yeah, so I'm yeah, doing it for sure. myself. And if I feel like I want to get a bigger ass to feel confident, not like if I'm not confident, but if I feel like okay, yeah, what's there? Mm. What's there? I really yeah. don't want to get a bigger ass. I love my ass. I don't want. I don't want too big. I don't want too small. Yeah, want... but you just want that waist. Yeah, yeah. snatched waist. Is that what you get it. You get it. Yeah, properly. Yeah, and get out. That's it, breathe. <laughs> all right so and you do have a dream body do you have well i think i'm okay with my body but i just have to like work on it so i can keep in shape in shape yeah. oh yeah. right i know a lot of you guys out there have a dream body and so those guys who get body shamed you guys who get body shamed a lot i need you to understand that you're beautiful you're strong yeah. you need to be confident in yourself yeah. you know it took me a lot of time to build my confidence and self-esteem again okay. yeah so but if you feel the need to go out there you have a dream body go out there go get it guys yes yeah. you need to get it you need to look good for yourself yeah. there are also exercises you could do i have been you know when you when you start to working out you start checking out this body goal apps and stuff like that i realize there are a lot of exercises you could do for every little thing if you want to feel confident yeah i believe that confidence starts from you so if yeah, you also feel true. like ah, oh, my hand is too big and you know there's actually something that you can do to reduce it then why not there's really no crime yeah go yeah. towards those apps you know go to the gym eat well people yeah. do not eat well all in the name of Healthy. i love i want to feel confident eat properly yeah take vegetables it even help your skin to glow glow yeah it does so it you guys should also stop body shaming it's not nice it's not nice, it's not at, nice all. at all you have to stop because you have to stop a lot of people out there they're even better than you that your body shaming exactly even our so-called um, models and stuff they go through so much some of them don't eat to get that body to yeah get that body. so you know just stop body shaming people and allow people to breathe allow people to know where we're trainers their life. <laughs> and corsets and that's what you used to do Abby. don't you do it no? <laughs> I literally do not wear waist trainers. Like, no. Ah, Matilda, you have cast me. <laughs> <laughs> because I don't, oh, guys, I don't, I, don't, I don't do that all the time. That's a lie. I don't. Stephanie. Stop it! I said no! Look at wearing waist trainers. Look at wearing waist trainers right now. No, 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 no,
<laughs> me, I just don't even know where you're showing us. I'm okay with my tummy. I'm going to take it down a bit. This full power, yeah, I'm not going to get it. But you know, anyhow, Sha, you guys stop body shaming. Spread love this month. This is the month of love. Make sure you spread love and light and not love and legs. It's very, very important. I'm going to say it again. Don't spread legs. <laughs> Do not spread legs this month. Anyhow, so make sure you drop your comments. If you have any experiences, make sure you drop down in the comments below. Somebody could be reading and, you know, just get inspired. Like, where we shared ours, well, I'd really love for you to share yours too. Uh, if you if you feel like you want to enhance your body, it's good to do so. I'm not against BBLs, I'm not against anything, but just make sure you're doing too and you're not affecting your health. Mm, okay. yeah. I'm not against wearing waist trainers too. If you, <laughs> if you like wearing waist trainers, I'm not It's not my business. My own is be happy whatever you're doing. Yeah. And yes, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, make sure you turn your post notifications on. Make sure you drop a comment down below. Share. We'll see you guys. We love next you guys. Week. Love you. Bye. Bye.